Hello Retirement Journeyers. I gotta come up with a name for all of us people who are beyond retirement, <clears throat> but not ready to retire. Uh, if you can think of something, let me know. I was listening to a podcast this morning about memories, and another one about knowing when to hang up your hat, so to speak. The uh, host talked about basketball players, great basketball players, who uh, continue to play past their time. They got uh, demoted into college leagues or out of college leagues, into farm leagues, and then nobody clapped when they came on the court or when they left the court. Same with a few great football players. I wonder if it's the same for those of us who stick around in a job for a long time. I guess it's hard to say. It depends what your job is. It depends how your performance is going. I'd like to think that I haven't outlived my welcome, so to speak, or outlived my utility in the current job that I'm doing. But I have to question myself every once in a while when I'm not remembering all the steps that I should be taking for a given project or Someone asked me a question and I forget some of the things I should check. I guess that can be said for anybody. Um, it doesn't really matter whether you're of retirement age or not. As you uh, move along in a job, you get better at it, hopefully. And at some point, you get to the point where you've maybe reached the pinnacle of your expertise. It doesn't mean you should quit, but maybe it means you should continue to work hard and not let things slide. Now, I don't know whether I'm letting things slide. I don't think I am, even though I've only got a month or so to go. I believe I'm doing the best that I can, but sometimes I wonder because every once in a while someone will ask me a question after I've given an answer and it'll be something I should have thought of, but I didn't. That worries me. And it also worries me about what I'm writing down for my successor because I have to make sure that I do a good job of leaving notes for whoever is going to follow me because I'm not going to get a chance to train that person. Some people won't need much training because they've done similar jobs in the past, but it's possible that a brand new person could come into whatever job you're doing or the job that I'm doing and at that point they're going to need some help. Maybe your supervisor can help. Maybe they're busy with their own job and they're not going to be able to do that. So I think it's really important to remember who you are in terms of the position that you hold because you don't want to step out of it before your time has come. I guess that's my thought for today. This is Jackie signing off for Thoughts from the Hot Tub.